Alright, so in this video I'm going to walk you through um, custom images. So we're going to use this to basically set up a little auto miner using RSK. And yeah, so I hope this is um, somewhat useful. So just going into RSK, clicking from client screen. And um, we're just going to call it silver. And then we're going to click like that. And we're going to hit record. And then if we go back into RSK, you can see that it's a spec. Uh, because we've clicked two points, it then makes the image from that client screen. So now, um, what we're going to do is. I'm just going to do this particular mine um, just to demonstrate it. So then I'm just going to go into bind actions and we're going to go on, I think it's down at the bottom, custom move. So we put on silver. Then I'm going to put on a left click. So mouse click left. And we're then going to add a, uh, add a pause in, a wait. And then we're going to wait for three seconds. And we're going to bind this. Oh, sorry, you couldn't see. <laughs> uh, we go on to custom move, select silver, left mouse click, and then sleep for 3,000 seconds. We're going to save this to key seven and save. So now when I press key seven, uh, let me just. Um, Recalibrate because I've moved the screen. Um, then we get, go back in here, and I'm going to hit seven. I, you can see it mines the rock, so that's good. Then if you press seven again, mines the rock, and then likewise if we were to. Now what we're going to do is we're going to add deviation in. Um, so we go into configuration. We're going to make it like 200 just to show it off. And now I need to recalibrate. So just recalibrate. And then if I press, okay, you can see it clicks in a different place. Like so. So that's basically just an auto miner um, using a image because it's a big one. So if you want to make it totally um, like automated, as it were, let me just go into bindings and disable all of these. Uh, yep. So now what we want to do is I'm just going to drop these real quick. Uh, I don't have shift drop on this one. Oh, good. Um, so yeah. now here, um, so if we wanted to mine more than one, we'll add two different images in. So let's go in here. And all right, so now we're just going to record from a uh, client screen and we're going to record this rock here. And we're going to call it Silver 3. I tried recording um, still this rock, but because my player's in the way. It didn't really work, so we're going to call this silver three, and we're just going to make it like that, and we're going to record, and now we're going to go into RSK here, and we're going to bind to key, uh, I mean this key three, um, three, but um, we're going to go down, and we're going to do a custom move, just going to custom move silver. Going to left click silver, going to wait three seconds, then we're going to custom move silver three, then we're going to left click again, then we're going to wait three seconds again, and we're going to save that to number three. So when I press number three, it mines here, one, two, three, then it mines this rock over here, one, two, three and it will mine. So 
that's how you do mining and then obviously in my previous videos I showed you how to drop stuff um, so on the end of your dropping you would add um, on the end of your thing you would just add a uh, you'd add shift down, so shift toggle down. So to drop the logs, the ore, you would do that, and then you'd do inventory position. So click inventory slot one, two, say, and you go down, you'd hit shift up. So that's how to, for example, do an auto miner in RSK. Um, just bear in mind it's searching for an image. So if you take an image and the image changes, it's gonna break. So one rock is very easy, pretty much never break. Mine for as long as you like. Um, two rocks, probably fine. Start doing three rocks, your player's gonna get in the way, so it's not gonna register the image anymore. Like if you move the screen like this, probably not gonna register the image anymore because that image is different from this image, for example. So just bear that in mind, and yeah, I hope this video is helpful. And yeah, that's all I really wanted to, oh, for looping it, it's in my auto alka video, but I'll also show you. Um, to then loop it, what you want to do is you make your number three, so you save number three, and then you bind to key four, would just be um, loop binding, and you just loop, so that loops action number three. So yeah, but that's all in my auto alka video if you need help on that. Uh, message me any questions if you need help but yeah I hope that is helpful and yeah bye uh, if you want any other videos made uh, drop me a message and I will make them probably within a week um, so yeah hope that's helpful